passed a bill to put a school resource officer on every Kentucky campus. A 2019 law would have already done that, but today they're only in about half of schools statewide. Bodie Brooks explains how the bill lawmakers are looking to pass could close the loop. In addition to helping districts pay for taking on an SRO, the bill also looks to answer the question over why so many districts don't have them. But opponents say not every district wants them, and they'd rather see a bigger focus on mental health. The question today is not should there be an SRO. The question is how can we get an SRO in every school campus? 2019 School Safety and Resiliency Act was supposed to put school resource officers on each public school campus, but Representative Kevin Bratcher says they're only on about half. Why aren't they doing that? Well, the obvious is, you know, the lack of funding and, and uh, the lack of personnel. But it's not there in black and white. Branch is sponsoring House Bill 63 to help close the gap, giving help to districts with funding challenges. If you can't afford the intentions of the School Safety Act, then send, send your reasons to the School Safety Center and let's work on a plan to get you there. The bill would also collect statistics for the state's annual school safety report, putting in print why some districts can't afford officers. There's a lot of things that they need. Um, but more officers in schools, or an officer in this case, um, for her school is not one of them. Um, and certainly not someone else uh, with a gun. Parents like Lyndon Pryor not on board with the plan, pointing to data that says SROs don't stop school violence. Others say the focus needs to be elsewhere. You have said nothing about funding mental health therapists. You have said nothing about sending social workers into schools. The bill passed out of the House Education Committee with three no votes and more than 15 yeses. Bratcher says he also agrees that mental health services should be funded, and he hopes to see more of that further down the road. At the state capitol, Bodie Brooks, Fox 56 News. And just last night, we saw the importance of having a school resource officer as an unruly fan disrupted last night's middle school basketball championship game between McNabb and Bourbon County. The fan, who was found to be in possession of a gun, was arrested for displaying inappropriate behavior and had to be tackled by the school's resource officer. Fortunately, the gun was not used during the incident, and all parents and students were safe.